A vast comparison from Peterhead's last game, the Petrofact Training Cup final, they came to Glebe Park hoping to cement second place in what's been a great season for the Blue Town. Yet bottom side breaking would be no pushovers, Andrew Jackson with a fine finish from close range. Breaky would soon make it 2-0, some dodgy defending leaving Robert Thompson for his first of the afternoon, calmly chipping Peterhead keeper Graham Smith. Different luck for Breakin City keeper Graham Smith, who would collect a rare assist. The game would be played in good spirits, yet referee John McKendrick would correctly play advantage before booking Jamie Robson once the ball went out for a corner. Peter Head, however, would soon show their quality, which has shone through in League One this season. No one would expect fullback Nathan Blockley to score when he picked the ball up just beyond the halfway line. Yet a cool run would leave the breaking midfield behind, and up Meg on Gary Fusco for good measure, but for a calm finish into the bottom corner. His first league goal of the season, and surely his best. Blockley's work, however, would soon be undone, as after Peterhead could only half clear their lines, James Dale would find Robert Thompson, who would brilliantly knock it down for Liam Watt, who would drill it low and hard past Smith. The game would all be sealed on the stroke of half time, yet after a great play from Randy Diazowski, he would give it away. And following a lovely through ball to Jamie Robson, Smith would deny him, yet it left a tap in for Thompson. Into the second half, and Breakin would continue to dominate, perfectly shown with a lovely lofted ball from Jamie Robson to Liam Watt. He would return the favour to Thompson, knocking it down for the striker, who would take his time and calmly place the ball under Smith. The start of the game, and Breakin's fifth. Final score at Glebe Park, Brayton City 5, Peterhead 1.